Hello, today's tutorial is about the accessories for the single bed that we made last week. I will show you how to make the pillow, the cushions, and the bed runner. These are the materials that you need to gather. So these are the printed materials that I printed on the cloth and I am going to use this in making the pillows, the cushion and also the um, bed runner. There is a free pattern for this, just check it down on the description box. And these are not my creation, I did not make this pattern. I got this from the internet and I simply scaled it down to 1 to 12 size. Then I cut each pieces giving them enough allowance for sewing. These are the pieces that I will be using for the entire bed. This one will be used as a bed runner. This one is for the main pillow and this two small square will be the cushions and a round cushion. For the main pillow and the bed runner, I am going to add an embroidery simply by following the printed lines or the printed sign. I decided to add embroidery because the print didn't show up clearly and it somehow looked very plain and not realistic. It took me more than an hour to finish the embroidery on two pieces and I wasn't fast, I admit that, and I poked my fingers several times while doing this. And here's how they look like after I added the embroidery. Next, I am going to sew the bed runner and the main pillow using a sewing machine. Make sure to flip the embroidered part inside and leave an opening when you sew it so you can flip it back. And here is the already so uh, sewn pieces and I am going to flip them again so I can fill the pillow with the toy stuffing. And here are the pillow and the bed runner. For the bed runner, I didn't fill it with anything, but I did iron it to make it flat. And I only ironed the back side because I don't want the printed materials to stick on the iron. Then I added an extra decoration around the bed runner. I don't know how it is called exactly. I found this on the Christmas decoration area which was on sale and I thought it would be nice to use for miniatures. For the square cushion, I added some markings before I sew it so that it would be easier for me to know that I am not sewing on the printed part. I then cut the excess fabric and flipped the pillow back and then added the stuffing and neatly closed the opening with an invisible stitch.
Next, I made the tassels for the square cushion and I cut a piece of cardboard about 2.5 centimeters. Then I wrapped the cross stitched thread around the cardboard until I was satisfied with the thickness of the thread. Then I cut one side of the thread to half and remove it from the cardboard and then I used the clothespin to keep the thread together. Next, I tied the other end with the same thread, adjusting it so that it will be a little bit closer to the edge. I tied it several times and secured it with a double knot. Then I trimmed the end of the tassels to make it shorter and even. I then separated each strand to make it look fluffier. So I made 8 tassels in total for each pillows. To attach the tassel, thread the needle in the center of the tassel. This will keep the tassel centered in the corner of your pillow. And then sew it several times and secure it by threading the needle to the opposite side of the pillow. And here's how they look like. So here I have already sewn the round cushion and I also cut the sides so that it would um, keep the shape of it. But I think I made a mistake of sewing it with the sewing machine. I think for an expert like me, hand sewing it would have been the best. Then I added the toy stuffing and I tried to put more of the stuffing ho hoping it will make a better round shape. Unfortunately, it didn't work. So I hope yours look much better than this. Then to complete the round cushion, I added a small bead in the center of the pillow. You can of course add some laces on the sides of the cushion to make it even look nicer. Thank you for watching this tutorial and I hope you enjoyed it. Please help me grow my channel by clicking the subscribe button. Thank you and see you next Saturday. Bye bye!